beautiful people welcome back to another video welcome back to my channel here is Tinkerbell say hello if you'd seen my previous vlog video you know that we look after Tinkerbell every week so she's having her sleepover this week she stayed over didn't you darling so today's video is going to be a full day of eating everything that I'm sort of eating at the moment to lose weight at the moment I'm um, currently trying to drop some body fat so I'm going to take you along with me today and show you basically what I eat to lose some weight so I have already lost a little bit of weight this week um, which is good so I'm going to take you along with me and I'm also going to go into detail if obviously you're trying to lose weight as well what things to actually think about and what things to make sure that you do but I'm going to show you what I'm currently eating and doing to lose weight I just also want to put out a disclaimer you don't need to lose weight to be happy this is currently what I'm doing to lose weight so if it doesn't work for you it's not for everybody it's not a quick fix and I am a qualified personal trainer however don't try and lose weight unless you are 100% um, sure that is the right thing to do I definitely wouldn't suggest to just go on any kind of diet always do your research before but yeah I just wanted to put out that little disclaimer I'm just what I'm just going to add as well is everybody is different so I do eat different things every day um, but this is going to be a typical day of what I eat on a Sunday. I'm not really doing an awful lot today so I will show you what I do and how to sort of incorporate your favourite foods in your day to day eating habits so that you can still lose weight but also so that you can still eat foods that you like. That is what we're going to do today. I'm going to show you what I eat to lose body fat. Quick tip that I would suggest if you are trying to lose weight and to just stay healthy is to drink enough water. I literally take this around with me everywhere. I just drink water whenever, really. It's good for your skin and it just clears you out. Okay, so for my breakfast, I'm going to have oats with a banana and some honey. Pretty simple, but it's very filling as well. And I think that's one of the main things to, to think about when you are trying to lose weight. You want to feel full uh, because obviously you're eating slightly less. Um, so you don't want to feel too hungry. So I'm going to have oats with a banana. So I'll show you how I do that. basically my breakfast that's what I'm having um, so bowl of oats with chopped banana on top and um, sometimes I would also put some frozen berries in but to be honest I kind of forgot but sometimes little tip I will put frozen berries in at the top at the bottom of the bowl and then put the hot oats on top and it helps the frozen berries to melt so it's really really good um, but I'm gonna have this for my first meal this will keep me going until my next <laughs> Like I said I've just had my oats so I do have oats most mornings to be honest for my breakfast just because they're quick and easy I normally make overnight oats and um, just take to work with me but this morning I was just kind of craving um, some oats and some bananas so something quite sweet reasoning behind that is because oats and especially bananas and fruits and things like that are very high in fiber as well so fiber is actually a really important nutrient if you are wanting to lose weight or try and eat a little bit less fiber is going to help you feel fuller for longer and we do need a set amount of fiber each and every day so i'm just going to run through some of my basic tips for anybody that is wanting to lose some weight and drop some body fat the first thing that you need to make sure you're doing is eating in a calorie deficit i'm gonna put this bluntly there are no foods out there that will magically make you lose weight there are foods that are gonna 
probably benefit you a little bit more in terms of your health and make you feel better um, and also make sure that your body's getting enough nutrients there are also some other foods that will probably be best to make sure that you're eating more of um, rather than less when you are trying to lose weight as well the main thing I would suggest would be try and include foods that keep you fuller for longer so obviously when you're in eating a calorie deficit whether you're either tracking your calories or cutting down your portion sizes anything like that you are taking in less energy so you are naturally going to start feeling a little bit hungry that's just how weight loss works unfortunately your body isn't getting enough energy that it would usually have in terms of food so it has to obviously use body fat for fuel so obviously the main goal really is to make the whole process enjoyable and feel fuller basically so the main goal really is to feel full and satisfied as best as you can so eating certain foods like for example foods high in fiber oats fruit uh, brown rice brown bread and things like that are gonna help fuel you for longer and also a lot of vegetables as well kind of just puts that hunger feeling at bay because let's be honest nobody likes to feel hungry my second tip would be to make sure that you're including foods that you actually enjoy because like i said the one of the main reasons why most people fail on diets or don't stick to them very long is i think they're too restrictive too soon so they cut out literally all their favorite foods and and they maybe cut out everything too soon so they're literally running on empty so they may for example go from eating 2200 calories every day and then cut out certain things or cut their calories and drop down to 1200 that's a thousand calorie deficit so that's a hell of a lot of calories that you are missing out on so obviously after time and over time your body is going to be screaming out for food and you're more than likely and I can speak from experience gonna go and binge on a lot of foods a lot of those foods are going to be high in fat sugar so you're probably gonna end up overeating and probably gain back all that weight that you've lost so my personal approach that I'm going with is cutting my calories down and doing a 10% calorie deficit um, so what I have done there and I will make a separate video on exactly how to do this I've cut out 250 calories away from my maintenance calories so it's a 250 calorie deficit which to put that into perspective is the size of a small chocolate bar so it's not that big that you would probably feel it and yeah at times sometimes I may feel like oh I would have something extra now but it's a much smaller deficit than cutting out a thousand calories and as well I will try to include as best I can like foods that I love so I'm a sweet person I love chocolate and things like that so I will do my best um, on certain days that I'm craving them um, I'll have those kind of things they are my main tips you need to be in a calorie deficit in order to lose weight no foods are gonna magically make you lose weight to make sure that your starting calories or your method isn't too restrictive so don't try and cut out everything and starve yourself when you first start trying to lose weight because it's going to set you up for failure in the long run you're probably going to get into a diet and binge cycle which is not going to be good for weight loss if you want to maintain your weight it's best to do a slow and steady moderate calorie deficit like 10%, 10% calorie deficit. And thirdly, include foods that you enjoy. So your biscuits or your chocolate, your crisps, or your pizza, whichever you prefer. Make that around 20% of your daily calorie intake. So so that you have something to look forward to, you know, have that chocolate bar in the evening or, or something like that. So you're still enjoying your favorite foods. That way you're gonna be able to maintain it for longer. It's much more realistic. But yeah, I hope that helped anybody that is maybe wondering about what to do like I said I will probably make a separate video on exactly how to lose weight but that's currently what my strategy is I'm just in a 250 calorie deficit at the moment so from 
what my maintenance calories are I've dropped it 250 calories and so far it is working so quick update on my full day of eating it's about one o'clock at the minute so I obviously have my breakfast quite late so I'm just gonna hold off until I have my next meal so to tie me over I'm having one of the high protein bars from my protein I think this has about 20 grams of protein in it and about 280 calories per bar low in uh, sugar and also low in fiber and literally guys if you look outside the weather is insane like, it doesn't look that bad but we're literally having a storm at the moment so I just tried to take Tink out for a walk and I got about five foot down the road and she was so wet so we came back because it's literally horrible outside so yeah I'm gonna have this and then I'll show you my next meal after that so next meal is gonna be some of these chicken sausages and some egg on toast <laughs> conclude today's video guys thank you so so much for watching like i said at the start of this video this is just a snippet every day is different i don't particularly eat every single meal the same some meals are similar but it just so happened today that it was you know that's how it turned out and um, so my last meal you would have seen i had the salmon with some veggies and also some potato as well so that's obviously going to keep me full until tomorrow so yeah so that concludes obviously my day of eating i will also point out as well i am like i said i am tracking my calories at the moment and i use my fitness pal to do that like i said at the start you everybody is different you don't have to even lose weight to be happy that's just what my goal is at the moment and there are other strategies to do that as well so you could even you know cut out portion sizes or you know um, just look at your eating habits but for me counting calories at the moment is what's working for me but yeah I think the basis of of my sort of strategy is to try and get as much nutrients as I can and then obviously try and fit in some other things I was actually going to have pizza tonight but it turned out that I couldn't be bothered to go out and buy any we didn't have any in the house so it turned out that I just had the salmon that we already had in the house if you like the video, if you found it useful, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really, really does support me. I know I'm only a small YouTuber, but I would love to interact more with people. So if you have any tips, want to want me to film or talk about anything in particular, please, please let me know. Every comment that anybody ever makes or any anyone who views these videos, you don't realise how much I appreciate them. But yeah, that's going to conclude today's video guys. Really hope you enjoyed it. I love filming these videos as well. Hope somebody took something away from today's video. Have a amazing rest of the day, whatever you are doing. Stay happy. Me and Tinky are going to go have a cuddle, cuddle sesh now aren't we i will see you in next week's video guys just to keep you posted i post every sunday that is my at the moment that is my posting schedule as well so but until next week i will see you in next week's video bye guys yeah.